at the installation of a Kit 300. I'm just pulling off the grill of a Honda Accord 1996. You're looking at the water reservoir with two tubes, one leading in and one leading out, going to the hydrogen generator. And you're looking now as well at the electrical connections. And they've been tucked away very neatly around the outside of the engine housing. And you can see how they both kind of curve around very neatly. And that's the end of the line for the electricals. That's the hot or the positive going to the battery. And you're looking at the filter uh, where the hydrogen goes into first out of the water reservoir and then into the air intake prior to the fuel injection system. And now we're going to take a look at the electrical components that are in the electrical line. First we see the ampere meter, which is very helpful because you want to monitor that you're getting a good 10 amps. And right beside it to the left is a on-off switch so you can turn off the hydrogen system at any time and a connector module and you're looking at a ground system there's only two wires going to it that we created to ground everything and to the right of the ampere meter we've got a diode one for the ground and you can see the red hot just kind of snuggled underneath the air intake and going to the hot on the battery and the uh, filter in the background there and we're just going to take another look at the main components, uh, the first one being the actual hydrogen generator or HHO generator. Here's one that's out of the box. And it's exactly the one that's installed, as you can see below in this Honda. And that's a view from the front. It's nicely placed, so it's got good airflow around it, keeping it cool. Even though it doesn't get very hot. Uh, won't because it's well placed that way and you can see the hot and cold the positive and negative is going to the generator and one last look at the water reservoir where the um, hydrogen gets bubbled from the water and then into the engine through the filter and then into the air intake 